Hello, my name is Mark Cabell and I've worked in the print industry for over 30 years. Today, I'll be demonstrating Poster Artist, Canon's cloud-based design and print tool. Okay, so you have downloaded Poster Artist, fired up the software and you are greeted with the home screen. Just on a navigational front, you have these icons here for different applications, poster, banner, flyer. So you can instantly choose which application uh, is applicable to your job. The second tier is you can drill down even further into um, areas, business areas. You know, here we have sale, food, beverage. And then the third tier is that you can look at these thumbnails of the preloaded templates. Okay, so now I'm going to show you very quickly how you can take one of the templates and make edits specific to your requirements. So I've preloaded um, a template and from the vast array that's available. So as I said, each artwork is, is made up of individual editable elements. Again, all text is editable, so if you, even if you wanted to change the text that's there, that's an option. And uh, as I've said, there's tools there to let you change fonts and weights, and so that, you know, that's really good. We've got some orange text, which if we select, is just a, a standard orange color. So you can specify a, a fluorescent ink and then when the artwork prints, that will print in, in the fluorescent, which can be amazing, uh, have amazing uh, impact uh, on, on a flyer or a poster. And you can move things around if you, if you so wish. You can see instantly, I mean, that's, that's been probably less than a minute, and I've taken that um, template, uh, made a couple of edits, added, you know, a fluorescent ink um, option, and you can go straight to print and, you know, you've got a happy customer. Okay, now I'm gonna show you how you would create your own piece of artwork using all the tools that I outlined uh, previously. So we're back on the, the home screen. In the top right-hand corner, we've got Create New. So new blank page, a blank canvas, basically, to work on. Now here you've got your preloaded piece of artwork images that you wanna use on this piece. We have a photo library available within the package um, and you get a whole raft of photographic images through three um, photo libraries and there's a search function in here as well so um, we are going to create a quick flyer poster for a cafe so I'm going to create a background I'm quickly going to draw a rectangle and I'm going to fill it now I'm going to choose one of these fluorescent colors because I think it's really going to give it some punch. I'm going to go with that color to begin with. Now I want to flood the background with with that color. So I have got sizing tools, handles, which I can drag out just like that. Client supplied their logo. So we'll get that on the page and um, I'm going to put that top left and I can scale. And when you scale the artwork Scales in Pro, which is, again, great. So we've got some images. We've got Cupcake. Uh, and again, that background is working really well with the pink tones in that photo. Um, we'll grab a coffee image. So you can see quickly, it's, it's kind of coming together. I've got a picture here of a customer. Just gonna resize and reposition these. So now I want to add a bit of text. Select our text. We're going to go horizontal. I can then just increase that. Um, and as I said before, we've got options to choose different fonts. So if I can go in there, we've got a little drag down menu. Yeah, that's better. So we, we've got a script. I'm going to, going to paint it in white. So it'll punch out from the background. So that, yeah, look, that starts to leap out of the pink. So I'm going to move that under there. 
Okay, the customer wanted a coupon uh, to go on this line. Okay, so we're going to create another rectangle. So I'm choosing the rectangle tool. We will size it so it runs, it's almost like a tear off if you like, a coupon, just to sit under that headline. So this will be the area for our coupon. There is um, an option to add textures. There's an option for gold and silver textures so you, you create your area and you can, like you would fill it with a color, you fill it with a texture. So instantly you can see, you know, I've, I've used the gold and again, it gives it that luxe sort of high, high quality feel. Instantly you, you're, you've got options to change through the fluorescence and the textures. You can add that zing that a fly like this uh, might need. We'll lock that again because we're going to be working on top of it. Um, here's our text, horizontal. There's our text box, and I'm going to say coffee coupon. One could finesse a bit more if, if one wanted to, but ultimately, within minutes from scratch, you've created a flyer. Okay, so we've created our artwork and we're happy. So now it's time to print and you'll see in the top right hand corner, uh, we have a proceed to print button and it's a click away. And uh, hopefully we'll show you the end result.